Today on Tools and Action, you guys, we're going to Menards. All right, you guys, let's take a look at what they got here at Menards. So first, uh, this is their Highline stuff. This is the Metabo HTP line. Definitely uh, cool stuff. It's the old Hitachi. It's not related to the other Metabo. Different battery platform, but totally different technology. But triple IP56 rated triple hammer impact is a great little impact if you guys are in the market. Let's move down a little bit. So this is Master Force. This is like their mid-range stuff right here. Um, I know a lot of people that use that little Master Force bandsaw, and it gives the Milwaukee a run for the money. Um, it's a 20 volt though, 18, 20 volt. Then we can go into the Bosch here. And obviously Bosch is a step up. Um. Yeah, they got a lot of Bosch here. A lot more than you'll see at Depot or Lowe's. Maybe not Lowe's. Okay, you guys, this is regular Hitachi before it went with Tabo HTP. So this is the old stuff. They're going to be renaming it soon. But as that stock goes out, they'll be replacing it with the Metabo HTP lineup of things. Probably, I don't even know if those models are still going to be around. But most likely they will. Works, that's a great gift for... Uh, Someone in your family that uses tools, but not really every day. You know, someone that wants a kind of a pretty good tool in their drawer. I, we talked about this at Lowe's, $79 for that um, switch driver, which is awesome. Um, this is one of the favorite, this used to be called the, uh, the Transformer. It was green, I can't remember if it was Rockwell, but it was the Transformer. This is a cool little saw. That is a cool little jigsaw, you guys. You can get it some Black & Decker. Wow, look at this. Look how small that is. I've never seen one so small. What a cool little, it's like a pocket oscillating tool. So, four tool combo kit for 79. That's actually a pretty good deal. You can't beat that. So if you're looking for a gift for someone, that's actually pretty good. Um, and they have bare flashlight. How much is that? 20 bucks. Matrix, remember the Matrix? We did that years ago. So basically what the Matrix is, you guys, I don't see one up here, but it's a changeable head system, so you can put different heads on it. Um, it looks like that. A lot of Black & Decker going on over here, you guys. A lot of Bosch, too, and Master Force back in the mix. Autocraft. Never heard of Autocraft. They got a lot of like no name brands here too. And they're a cheap brand, you guys. The, the absolute Harbor Freight competitor that they get they have here is the uh, Tool Shop. And that stuff's competing against Harbor Freight. It's not, I mean, they have some cool tools. Like here's an inflator, it's got a cool gauge on it, but it just feels cheap, you know? Um, 18 volt. And I don't even know if this is NICAD or not. This is NICAD for 40 bucks. I mean, I would not buy a NICAD for 40 bucks. I'd maybe go lithium ion, but then we're looking at, well, that whole kit is 119. Um, yeah, I don't know about the tool shop stuff, you guys. Uh, the Performax is another brand I've been seeing here. Don't know much, too much about them, but kind of gimmicky, but could be kind of cool. This is very cool right here, and this is actually tool shop. Precision screwdriver. I used to rave about those years ago. Husky had them, and they looked kind of identical. And they're just great for small um, jobs, you know, opening up electronics and stuff like that. Corded, a great thing about Menards too is their big Bosch concrete lineup. So you can, you know, if you're a pro, you can come here. And they do have a ton of pro tools too. Let's go check out the next aisle. All right, you guys, here we have their sanders. Again, you know, you can get into the entry levels for $13.99. The tool shop, the next one up would probably be this Performax series. And then you go into your name brands, Skill, Black & Decker. I mean, Skill makes a pretty good one. Um, actually, so does Rockwell. But, you know, you could go from a belt sander to a sheet sander to a random orbit sander. I mean, Master Force, 54 bucks. Random orbit sander, not a bad price. But then also, they have a Bosch on sale for 59 So, mouse sanders. I don't know. I don't have much luck with mouse sanders of any type. Um, but... 
they work, I guess, for certain applications. So you, again, $13 for a sheet sander from the tool shop. If you're looking for something just cheap, just to get the job done, that'll probably get you going. But if you're looking for something that's gonna last and you know you wanna have comfort and you know better quality work, start looking into these. Probably start with this skill and move up to Porter Cable, then the Bosch. Bosch makes a really good sander. Recip saws, you guys, same kind of scenario over here. Um, you know, you have your high-end Bosch, and then you have your Master Force, which is your next high-end, their high-end brand. And then you have the Performax and the, uh, obviously, the $27 Tool Shop one. And you have some skill saw in there with Hitachi. Jigsaws all looking the same. And I apologize for the music, you guys. It's horrible. But YouTube will probably pull this video down anyway. Circular saws, you guys, all different kinds of corded circular saws. This whole section here is corded. Um, these little work saws are pretty cool. Again, same stuff we're kind of seeing at Lowe's, you know. We have a uh, the rip cut from Craig dual saw, 99 bucks. I don't know too much about that. It's got like two blades on it that run, I don't know how it works. But $27 for a circular saw, you guys, competing with the Harbor Freights of the world. So over here we have their grinder selection. So obviously we knew we were gonna see a tool shop for 18 bucks and we got angle grinders i mean if you're gonna go with an angle grinder from here i would just go with the bosch for sure actually wow oh that's cool it has the uh tool in the end i like that on the master force actually the master force looks pretty nice wow yeah that master force isn't bad at all Hitachi. So yeah, Master Force is gonna be their premium brand to compete with other premium brands. Um, Master Ford Bla Force Blades, obviously I haven't checked them out yet, but they have Tool Shop, Master Force, Bosch. Who they got for resips? So you're not seeing any Milwaukee here, but you're seeing Bosch, you're seeing Lennox, you're seeing Morse, and you're not seeing any DeWalt. So maybe they don't have DeWalt here. All right, guys, check this out. Bosch Compound Glide Miter Saw, $5.99 on sale. This is a nice miter. It has the glide system on it. So not only is it super smooth, you guys, but it allows you to put it up against a wall in a shop. So it's pretty awesome. Um, next, Delta, the Delta Cruiser. We don't see much Delta because you don't see it at Home Depot and stuff like that, but don't know much about this saw, but it's an option. Some more Master Force stuff. You guys remember Master Force is their premium brand. $349. More man wow, they got a lot of Master Force. And then just Performax. And then the tool shop. So you can get into a miter with a single bevel for 124 with the tool shop. But again, you guys, you're sacrificing quality, you know. Will it get the job done most likely? Is it going to be the most accurate? Most likely not. But it'll last, you know. A little 10 inch miter. There's a tool shop, seven and a quarter inch miter. Look at that. Wow, that's actually pretty neat. That's actually pretty cool. A little baby miter. All right, you guys, we'll come back and check this place out, but um, when the Christmas music's not blaring, but let us know what you guys think. This is all the stuff at Menards. If you want to see more Menards, comment below. Skill saw. This is a great table saw right here, you guys. This competes with Bosch in a big way. It's very powerful. There you have your Bosch. Remember, for more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.